What's up guys, it's Meg. Welcome back to Meg After Dark. We have all sorts of exciting things today. Um, I, because I watched <laughs> The Walking Dead mid-season premiere yesterday via AMC premiere, they did not show me that there was a promo for the second half of season 10 um, premiering, which we discovered premiering February 23rd, 2020. Um, we also got lots of exciting news today about the um, spinoff show and the new name, which I already did a video on that, but I decided to try and find this Walking Dead um, trailer for the second half of season 10 and I was able to find kind of a bootleg uploaded version <laughs> on YouTube because AMC did not freely post that after the episode aired which I was kind of bummed about um even on AMC premiere they did not show the clip which seems odd but whatever we are finding a way we always find a way uh and I'm gonna watch it right now and hopefully everything is in this clip um Sorry for the shiny lighting. It is a camera light um, because it's very dark out right now. Here we go. Thank you, one Fergus, one for posting this. The people you sent out, they're in trouble. Oh no, it's Gamma. I want to know if Gamma did that as a trap. It's Michonne. Uh-oh, Beta's going down there. No, you don't know if any of this is real. Oh, fuck! <gasps> Who is that? Watching us. The spy you're looking for, right here in your camp. Can't we turn my back on you anymore? Shit, that looks really close. Come on! Oh. I didn't mean for any of this to happen. kissing somebody I gotta go back hold on hold on hold on I gotta go back I gotta go back um one of my viewers said oh god oh god is that Rosita and Eugene yep one of my uh, friends said that it was Rosita and Eugene they look like they were gonna kiss what I said and I, I cut this out I think of my reaction video to um, the mid-season finale but I was <laughs> literally like uh-oh this looks like the end for Gabriel and hopefully it doesn't end up being Rosita and Eugene because I did not like that in the corner um so I hope that that's just a little something a little slip I hope that's not anything I'm not interested in that at all um what else oh my god okay let me go back for one I kind of like I it's it's up in the air whether or not Gamma is like a spy or Gamma is like on like wanting to turn against Alpha like we know that she definitely felt betrayed when she discovered that um Lydia was alive like she that really hurt her because she'd given everything even killed her own sister so much devotion and loyalty to Alpha to find out that such a huge um thing was that Alpha lied so I know that that like highly affected her thinking after that but she's very devoted to Gamma, I mean to Alpha, so I wouldn't put it past her to use that as a way to, I mean, it kind of seemed like everything was a trap, so Alpha was definitely expecting in the mid-season finale, Alpha was expecting our group to be there, obviously, she was waiting there, she caught Carol's attention, like, I'm pretty sure she was waiting for this, and she moved the I mean, she moved the herd out of that area where Gamma said. Um, so I'm not sure if Gamma just had wrong information or if it was really a trap set by Gamma because I'm kind of leaning more towards it was a trap. But, you know, I like to see the good in everybody. So <laughs> I don't know. Did any of that just make sense? Because I feel like I just rambled on and I'm not even sure if that made sense or not. Um, wow, this was actually for only being like a minute long. This was really good and it actually has me more pumped for um the next half of the season it looks exciting so gamma comes here to alexandria to s tell them that the front that are 
their friends are in trouble um, to tell them about them being trapped there but it kind of looks like nobody is believing her um, so we definitely know she's telling the truth there but we also don't know if it's again if she's kind of a spy and trying to get even more people out right so we and we also saw that I was thinking that the walkers were not that close um, to them in the cave but it does look like they're kind of pretty close there um, and then I saw this part where I'm just looking one more time uh, I have it on silent so I can't hear but this part right here where one of the whispers comes inside Rosita's house and I thought it was beta for a second but it's definitely not so I don't know what is up with that it doesn't look super threatening but also doesn't look good We see Negan and Alpha there. I was kind of hoping that was going to come to a head at the end of this um, season, but it didn't. We saw a glimpse of Michonne there, and there's Aaron. Um, it looks like they're trying to get them out of a tunnel. Maybe trying to save them. And then two interesting scenes, which I just missed the first time, were... Carol and Ezekiel right here. It looks like finally she's finding out the truth that he is um, dying. Thank God. And then this with Negan, it almost looks like they're going to kill him or something. Like that he's like, he looks like his life is about to end. So I'm not really sure what's going on there. Um, let me know what you guys thought of this trailer. Are you pumped for the second half of the season? Because I, I do have to say... As you guys know, if you watched my reaction video to the mid-season finale, I was not super like, it wasn't that it was bad, it just felt like an, a normal episode. It didn't really feel like a season finale, or a mid-season finale. So even though there was a cliffhanger, it wasn't like, I'm like, they're gonna get out, it's fine. You know, like, <laughs> I think The Walking Dead has conditioned me to be like, no, it's gonna be fine. It used to be that, like, you never knew who was gonna die ever, but I feel like this is, it's a little bit more like, mm, it's fine. Um, okay, I guess that's it. Oh, oh, my main TV just, it was on mute. Now it's not on mute anymore, so that's what you're hearing. Sorry about that noise. Um, let me know what you guys thought of the trailer. Are you excited for the second half of season 10? Um, what was your favorite part of this trailer? Let me know in the comments, and I will see you next time. I hope you have a great night. Bye.